Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Vice President National Sales Hyundai Motor America, Dave Zukowski. Welcome everybody. After a year like 2009, we all look for positive signs wherever we can find them. And I definitely see one here today with the turnout at Cobo Hall. Thank you for being here for what promises to be the start of a much better 2010. Now, with all the past changes, 2009 really put the focus right back where it belongs. And that's on the customers who drive our industry. In a very difficult year, Hyundai achieved a sales increase of 8%, despite the overall industry's decline of 21%. We did it by listening to our customers and responding to them in ways that, frankly, no one had before. No question, Hyundai is moving fast. And that's got us some attention. For example, in this Fortune magazine cover story, Hyundai is a tough competitor, but it's also a company that has a lot of heart as well. And that's evidenced by the commitment we've made to a very, very important cause. To discuss it, I'd like to introduce the dealer who represents Hyundai in beautiful Ann Arbor. He also happens to be the chairman of this year's North American International Auto Show. Please welcome Mr. Doug Fox. Thanks, Dave. Doug, how are you doing? I'm Thanks doing for great. Joining us. Well, I happen to be in the neighborhood. Thanks for having me. At Hyundai, we're very busy building a great company. But it's equally as important to us that we have a good company, too. One that gives back to society in very meaningful ways. And I'm wondering, Doug, if you could introduce us to a vital cause that we all share at Hyundai. It would be my pleasure. It's called Hyundai Hope on Wheels. And it's all about one thing, helping kids fight cancer. This effort began as a small dealer initiative, and it quickly became a nationwide cause for Hyundai, a cause that's now entering its 12th year. Today, the 12 major groups of pediatric cancers receive less than 3% of the National Cancer Institute's total research funding budget. So this is a cause that we know we can make a big difference. And we have. Through Hope on Wheels, Hyundai and Hyundai dealers have contributed over $14 million to childhood cancer research. And I'm proud to say that just this afternoon, Hyundai Hope on Wheels and our Detroit area Hyundai dealers presented a check for $50,000 to the Children's Hospital of Michigan to support their valuable research in this area. We look forward to being part of their continuing success. Doug, we thank you and all of our Hyundai dealers for being so committed to this terrific cause. It makes us feel better. And if you'd like to learn more about it, please go to our website at HyundaiHopeOnWheels.com. You may have noticed something different beneath the handprints of our Hope on Wheels vehicle over here. This is also the North American debut of the redesigned 2010 Hyundai Santa Fe. To tell you more about it, Please welcome the Director of Product Planning for Hyundai Motor America, Mr. Scott Margeson. Good afternoon. Many of you have heard about the product initiative we call 24-7 version 2.0. Once again, we're going to launch seven all-new products over 24 months, beginning with the all-new Tucson and Sonata. While these full model changes get a lot of attention, they're just part of Hyundai's commitment to bring our best thinking to our customers at Hyundai speed. A case in point, the 2010 Hyundai Santa Fe. Outside, the changes are subtle, but unmistakable from any angle. There's a new grille, fascia, and fog lights up front, new body side moldings and alloy wheels, and a new taillight design. But the big changes are under the hood. For 2010, Santa Fe offers two new engines that improve both performance and efficiency. The first is a new Theta II four-cylinder engine that outperforms last year's 2.7 liter V6. It improves acceleration and fuel efficiency, delivering 28 miles per gallon on the highway. Santa Fe also gets a new V6, the 3.5-liter Lambda 2. It's larger and more powerful than the 3.3-liter V6 it replaces, yet it delivers 15% better
better fuel economy. Both Santa Fe engines are now mated to Hyundai's new six-speed automatic transmission, which contributes to their improved efficiency. So a lot of news under the hood. But Santa Fe also gets important enhancements inside the cabin. There's a new touchscreen navigation system, which includes a rear view camera and XM nav traffic. Standard features now include Bluetooth hands-free connectivity and steering wheel mounted audio controls. Santa Fe has always been a good safety choice, and that's been enhanced with the addition of rollover sensors that keep side curtain airbags inflated when the system detects a rollover. Once again, six airbags and electronic stability control are part of the advanced standard safety on Santa Fe. Now, in keeping with Hyundai tradition, we continue to add even greater value to this new model. Last year's Santa Fe was an amazing value with a starting price of less than $22,000. But what about this year? Once again, thanks to the world-class engineering done here in Michigan, we've improved fuel economy and stepped up performance. We've added new content to an already impressive list of standard features. But we've kept the starting price unchanged at less than $22,000. We think customers will be delighted by that news. So that's our current product announcement. But what about the future? Today, there are a number of important fuel-saving technologies under development at Hyundai. Many of them are showcased by the concept we brought here today, the Hyundai Blue Wheel. Our entire industry is working to develop the next generation of sustainable transportation. Blue Wheel is one such solution, a vehicle designed to achieve 100 miles per gallon. Its efficiency begins with plug-in hybrid technology, but it doesn't end there. The hybrid system includes an efficient direct injection engine like that found in the all-new Sonata, and a motor powered by lithium polymer batteries, which will come in our hybrid Sonata later this year. To hit our fuel efficiency targets, weight reduction is essential. In fact, today, we're officially announcing our commitment to reduce Hyundai's average vehicle weight by 10% by 2015. So Blue Will is a very forward-looking concept, yet Hyundai has already adopted many of its advances for our newest wave of efficient and exciting vehicles. You'll see more innovations in new production models that we'll unveil later this auto show season. Now we invite you to come have a closer look at the Blue Will concept and the 2010 Santa Fe. Dave and I will do our best to answer any questions you have. Our president and CEO, John Krafchick, and our chief designer, Bill Zak, will also be on hand. Thanks for coming.